Well, uh, the Prime Minister, Anthony Albanese, is speaking. He's at uh, a Women's Day parliamentary breakfast, and uh, let's listen in. That we're making early learning cheaper to increase women's economic participation and to boost productivity. Uh, that, as of the 1st of February, Australian women now have access to 10 days paid domestic and family violence leave. These are practical measures which are making a difference. But as we're reminded today, when Australia ranks 43rd in the world as a G20 country for women's economic equality, there's clearly much more to be done. I look forward in a short while of welcoming the Prime Minister of Timor-Leste uh, here into Parliament today, uh, following the very successful meeting that we had uh, yesterday with the new Prime Minister of New Zealand. Happy to take a couple of questions. The ongoing rate rises could send Australia into a recession. Look, I, I am very hopeful, uh, backed up by the comments itself of uh, the Reserve Bank and, and others, uh, that uh, inflation has peaked and that what we will see from here is a downward trend. Uh, we know that the global economy in, arising from the Russian invasion of Ukraine has seen a global spike in inflation. And indeed, in some of the advanced economies, that reached double digits. So it hasn't reached that here, but it clearly is having an impact. We're not immune from the impact of the global economy in today's interconnected world. Take up hang, on, hang on, hang on. So they think about it. Think about it. Good. The Greens are calling on you to sack Philip Lowe and also to reverse the decision of the RBA yesterday, even if you could, would you? The, the Greens sometimes don't understand uh, the way that the economy works or the way that the system works. We have an independent reserve bank. That is a very important principle, one that we maintain, uh, one that uh, we won't be diverting from. Maybe one more from... Regarding offshore processing on Nauru, um, how did the government let that legislation lapse for four months and why did no one notice? Uh, there's no impact on it. Uh, it was dealt with uh, yesterday clearly by the parliament. Thanks very much. That is the Prime Minister, Anthony Albanese, speaking in Canberra.